tough world out there. You gotta, you gotta stick with your friends. Well, that's like, that's not like the objective. It's like, I guess some like advice for the states or something. It's like a, maybe it's just a sort of line, like a quote or something. Anyway, here's stage three and as you see, now you're playing as Jerry and now this time instead of fish, which is Tom's favorite meal. Now you're playing as Jerry. Jerry is a little bit, you know, plays a bit similar, still plays a bit similar as Tom, but the only difference is that Jerry's smaller. And you only kind of like cheese for, for him. So yeah, that's the only difference. This stage can get really hard as well if you if you don't know exactly where you're going, because you can get lost pretty easily. When I first time got got to the stage, I actually got lost quite a bit, and after a while, while going through this game, I um, I figured out where I, where I needed to go. And oh yeah, by the way, you can't throw your weapon when you're in the water, and oh man, I freaking hate this fish, I really do. I'm not exactly sure where this stage takes place in the movie, um, I think it's like, when you're, hmm, I'm not exactly sure where that is, I guess it's that, oh yeah, I think I remember, it's the scene where Tom and Jerry are, are in the alley after escaping from the house. Yeah, there we go. Actually, get that block of cheese. And man, that's a huge ass cheese. Um, huge ass, um, block of cheese or cut of cheese. You know, cheese, cheese everywhere. Freaking love cheese. Jerry loves cheese. I like, I like cheese. So I guess I'm kind of like a mouse. I like cheese. Cheese. Cheese everywhere. Yeah, get the cheese. Rah. Oh, careful now. Stay on the ladder. Yeah, this time you're going for ladders in this stage. And there's quite a bit of hazards in this one. Especially, there are some enemies in the game. In this, not in the game, like, um, like in the stage. Mostly underwater. But there's, but there are still quite a bit, like, over here. So I can't hit that guy precisely, so I'm just gonna skip him. Yeah, you have to sort of do a leap of faith over here. I didn't know actually when I got reached to this point. I think actually no, I don't think so. I think it's a bit later when I reach to it's kind of similar to that point, but it's a um, a little bit different in terms of scenery. Well, maybe not, but maybe it's because of the layout looks different. I, yeah, maybe that's why I'm be careful right there because I. I can't get you if you're not careful enough. But I'm doing kind of, kind of better. I, I usually do kind of bad in this stage, so so, so I'm surprisingly doing well for the most part. Yep. Yeah. This this one can get a little hectic. Those aren't instant death spikes, so don't worry. The only instant death is like, um, like. Pets. The only instant death in this game you're gonna have is pets. Or something, maybe. Maybe it could be something else. Oh, yeah, maybe Spike also. Yeah, oh, careful. Because when that fish sees you, he's gonna go rushing after you. When he sees you in front of you. When you're going behind him, he won't see you. He won't, like, rush like that. But when he sees you, like, he has eye contact, sort of. He will charge you and try to get you. So, do be careful. I'm going through, oh, like right here. Man. This side effect can get a little scary sometimes when when you're not expected the fish to come out. You know? So, oh. And, oh, no, 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 no. You can't exactly, like, press the jump button to go back to swim faster or something. You, can, you only, like, rely on. Um, only rely on, like, the D-pad of swimming in the stage. Only focus on the controls on the D-pad because you really can't do anything else other than swim. When you reach the near surface, jump for it and keep going. And oh my god, I'm actually really low on HP. Oh! I was about to say, why did I die right there? And, oh, right there, I just died. Alright, let's do this again. I'm always tempted to cut again because it's kind of a long 
trip, but uh, I don't know. Maybe I could rant about something if it turns out good or something because um, like almost any rant I do doesn't like while doing Let's Plays doesn't turn out that great. It's like it's like what's the point of me talking about it? He sounds so stupid, you know. So I don't know. And why am I still talking? I should be cutting. Well, maybe, maybe not. Maybe I'll just leave it. Maybe I'll just say some random stuff while going through the stage. Careful now, because from the stupid red. And man, why? And one question: How are these reds so freaking huge? And why are these reds so freaking huge? And just freaking fish? I don't know what it is. It's, I guess it's like a piranha, but it looks kind of polluted or something, like mutated, kind of. I don't know, maybe it's because of the map or how his eyes look. I don't know. You just keep going. If you're playing this on the two player, the, fir the first player is Tom and the second uh, one is Jerry, so yeah. I never explained that just yet until now. And Yeah, there you go. Yep. Yep. Oh, careful now. I don't know why I did that right there. I usually don't do that. Oh, careful! Hit the guy, and I fell down. Eh, whatever. Still have some time to do some things. Just mess around, you know, and just take it slow. Why is my freaking? Why is? Why does my thumb so hurt so much when pressing that that freaking B button? I don't know. And also, I didn't explain this, but I think you already know, know already, is that the C button is your throwing, throwing attack. Come on, get the gun, yes. Careful right here from the bars, because they fall pretty fast. That's just unusual, I guess. Do -do -do -do. Oh, yeah. Okay, that, that was actually kind of bad. I'm not, I'm actually not doing that good, because back at low health again, I should be a lot more careful than this. Sorry, slight interruption right there. So, let's just keep going, I guess, for this stage. I should be a lot more careful. No, don't get me, you stupid thing. Stupid rat. Stupid sticking rat. I'm just kind of taking it slow and Got to be here as well. <coughs> uh, I don't know where the other health thing is, so I should should be worried a little bit in terms of HP. Uh, you really can't go faster on swimming. Wait, can you? Uh, I'm not sure exactly. Maybe, maybe you do. Uh, and I don't think so. Probably. Careful! No stupid fucking octopus. Fuck. Careful. How great this guy can. Just do your jump. And let me go. Let me go, let me go, let me go. Hi, that's not even the end of the stage. There's still more things. There's still more to it. It just never ends. Brilliant. Freaking brilliant. You landed on the freaking enemy. Okay, I'll just cut. I'll you pro you already seen the stage two times, so I'll be right back. Stop getting hit by those freaking bottles! Kind of forgotten about 
bit of where everything is. I still remember the stages, some of them being really hard, and one probably I remember one being the hardest in the game. Shit. Oh, yeah, this part. I re yeah, this actually stopped me a little bit of where you had to go. I thought you had to go to the right when I first got through the stage, but I think you had to go to the left a little bit right here. Yes. Yeah, I should remember that. Hello, I'm Robin. Can you help me find my daddy? And now I'm on to freaking stage four, and I'm stretching like a freaking madman. Oh, it's good to stretch. It really does. Find the other guy from Robin's father. Oh, you had the freaking telegram. I can't remember where that move, that part of the movie is. I think. I think this is where. Tom and Jerry are trying to find the, the newspaper about about Robin's father. Yeah, I think that's it. Uh, my back is just my just back. This can this stage can get really rough as well because of the amount of freaking enemies and all hazards. Ah, and I'm kind of dying right now and. No sound from the piano, unfortunately. Oh, nice try. And it's not one piece you have to fight for the telegram. You have to find like two pieces. Oh, but, uh, dizzy, dizzy, dizzy. Oh, silly. There we go. That piece apart if you want it. And yeah, these book books you don't notice them right away if you kind of rush through it. It's like jeez. Yeah, here you stupid book. It's like, get out of here. Oh. Alright, alright. I could have turned it a lot worse, I think. Ink. Yeah, this time the throwable item is the ink. For some reason, and if you, when you hit the enemy, you, you get this little splash effect at the end. Yeah. And I think over here somewhere there should be the telegram. Of course, it's not really that easy. I had to find two pieces of the telegram. Telegram is torn. Where's the other half? Uh, I kind of think that's the same way too, Jerry. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Stupid spice and stupid book. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, there's a piece of part here. And you're back at the beginning of the stage. Now you have to go through a different path to find the other telegram part. Right now, I can't remember what that is. Hey! Stupid thing. You got me killed a little bit right there. You almost got me killed. Well, not really. Well, not yet. But you're giving me a step closer to dying. Yep. Uh, I think you have to go a bit further. Uh, throughout the lever than you think. Half an hour throughout the recording and you're only into stage four. Yeah, I think you have to go through here next to get the other part of the telegram. At least I'm sure. And that's not it as well. I, at least I, I'm pretty sure you have to. I think you have to take the piece to a certain spot. Somewhere. Uh, I could be wrong, but I think the other telegram part is over here. No, it's a piece of cheese! Yeah, I'll take it. I think I kinda need the help. Anyway. And you're back over here to where you were earlier. But if that was worth it, it gave me more ammo. Um. Piece of part. It's important. Hey, I got the pizza! Hooray! Or the cookie thing. I think that's pizza. I'm, pretty sure. I'm not exactly sure what that does. My guess would be is that it gives you a better ending or something. I, I'm not exactly sure what it does. If anyone knows what that does, those pizza things where you get all of them, let me know because I'm kind of interested. Oi! Book. Bookcase. Uh, yeah! Oh yeah! Now we're suddenly over here. Wait, this is where we were earlier, damn it! Ah! I think it's like at the highest point somewhere. Damn it. Oh well. 
Let's just keep going. I think we still have some time to get that art apart. I'm kind of thinking on my head. Is that... Does the stage end? We're getting... What? We're getting the other part of the telegram? Or is it... You have to take the telegram and reach it to a certain spot. I mean, I can't remember exactly. But I think that... But I think that's the case. Keep going. What? What the? Oh, I'm accidentally pressing the pause button from the, the desk. The pause button is accidentally getting pressed by the desk thing. I don't know how. Don't ask me how, but whatever. Yeah, I can't get rid of this guy and be careful with that book because sometimes that guy drops the book that is alive! Alive! And run like a madman. Block the shot, yeah, why not? And jump me into the enemy. Yeah, waste all of those things. Oh, frick. I think I have to save state because I can't remember where that are. Where you, you have to go exactly. Oh, wait, there's a. Spot over here somewhere. Oh, da, da, da. Where does this go anyway? I said. I'm not sure. Oh, it's the other part of the telegram. Robin's dad is safe. Help! Here comes the dog catcher. <laughs> 